What is going down, everybody? It's your boy, Divot Slice. I know I've been dormant for a while, and you have not heard from me in several months, but I've had good reasons, um, mainly because I've been going to different anime conventions throughout this year, uh, more than what I normally do, because as you guys know, or probably don't know, because I, I again, haven't really talked about it that much, but... Um, I've been going to different anime conventions throughout this year, um, more than just the typical one that I go to, which is Otakon. It's my home convention. I always go to that one. Um, this year, I've expanded out tremendously, uh, starting with Otakon, then I went to Katsukon, which is in National Harbor, D.C. I know there's like a huge gap. It's like a five or six month gap in between, but I went to went to that. Um, I went to Zenkai Con. That was in March. Um, again, a really, really good convention. Um, it's really small. Um, it's still relatively new. So, you know, that one was, you know, a new experience coming from somebody like me whose first convention was Otakon. So I'm used to the extremely big, crowded one. And, you know, having gone to a smaller one, it was actually really cool. Um, the next one I went to after that was Anime Next, which was in June. Um, th again, that one is another relatively uh, new one. It's about like six or seven years old, something like that. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section. It could be like nine years. I really, uh, it was my first time going, so I wasn't really caught up on that convention at all. But um, you know, went to uh, Anime Next. Um, again, it was a really nice one, really small, uh, still new, um, so that's that. And then, of course, in less than uh, a week now, we are under the week mark. It's literally like four days until uh, Thursday before Otakon, which is, if you are a seasoned convention pro, it's the pre-registration badge pickup day, so... Oh my god, all the feels. But anyway, um, we got uh, all that set up. Uh, if you haven't checked out my Facebook fan page for my cosplays, it's uh, www.facebook.com backslash divot 8 bit art. I'm going to make sure I put a little annotation here with the, the linkage. And um, it's got everything on there, you know, from cosplays I've been doing, props I've been working on, commissions that I'm going to actually start working on, and it's got my cosplay lineup for uh, Otakon 2013, which, of course, if you don't have a Facebook, I'm not going to make you go to the fan page. I'm just going to let you know right now, <laughs> so that just kind of defeated the purpose of telling you the list is there, because I'm going to tell you anyway. But doesn't matter. Um, this is how it's going to go. I have four cosplays for four days, so I'm including the pre-registration badge pickup day, and the order is going in the following. Thursday, I am going as Benny from Fallout New Vegas. If you have no idea who Benny is because you've been living under a rock or don't have the game, he is the guy that has the blazer, the checkerboard, black and white checkerboard. Um, he's kind of the villain. I mean, he shoots you in the head in the first, in the opening intro. So, um, gonna be Benny on Thursday. Friday. This one is my awesome cosplay. I do this one all the time. It's probably my favorite and the one that I can pull off the best, which is going to be Choji from Naruto. And I'm going to show you this wig. It's a mess because I haven't restyled it since anime next because it fell apart when I put it in its container. But Choji is going to be Friday, Saturday, um, I'm wearing the wig now, I'm going to restyle it, because again, it looks like crap in the back, I'm not even going to show you the behind the scenes, but uh, yes, Saturday, I'm going to be Niku from the game The World Ends With You, if you have not played that game, or you don't have a DS, I recommend you go out, and I recommend you to buy that game. It is absolutely phenomenal. It's made by the same team that made Kingdom Hearts, hence why Nico actually shows up in uh, the game for the 3DS. I want to say it's uh, Dream Distance Drop, something like that. Um, and then finally on Sunday, this one is my newest addition to my cosplay uh, lineup. Uh, I only wore and de debuted this one at Anime Next, and that is my Steampunk Han Solo, which actually is 
one of my favorites. Um, not it's one. It's in my top three. I'll push you that way. I mean, I only know I have like five cosplays. I have a bunch of them in the future to worry about. Um, but yes, uh, Han Solo is one of my favorites. I've always been a Star Wars fan. My my whole family is like, oh my gosh, Star Wars! Like, if you only knew. <laughs> so um, that's gonna be my cosplay lineup. Um, don't be afraid to come up and say hi to me at Otakon. I'm not, you know. A mean person. <laughs> uh, I'll talk to like anybody. So um, yeah, don't be afraid to come up, say hi. I'm always willing to talk to people. And um, yeah, hope to see you there. Peace out, my otaku. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh, wait for it. Wait for it.